Hi guys, I'm Exacaz and welcome back to another episode of Sim Airport. In this episode, we are going to try and finish off this uh, this, air, uh, this terminal building over here. So, I think first thing we need is some benches so people have somewhere to sit. Then we need some garbage bins and the like. So let's uh, I think start it over here. And we'll go one, we'll just try and do two nice rows um, of seating. And I hope that should be sufficient. I think the other side of this terminal over here um, could work well for like a cafe or you know something something like that okay now let's bring it back oh crap always always you can't you can't uh, and that one's wrong as well and now it's going to be built in the wrong direction you just can't seem to get away from doing it uh, getting something wrong huh We'll see how that one looks as soon as it's in there, but we're probably going to have to get rid of it now. We'll leave a little bit of a gap there. Uh, we may use it for like decorations and the likes. Excellent. And that's kind of where we're going to end it on this side. Then we'll do a similar thing on the other side of the escalators. Let's see how that looks. Did we mess up one over here? Yeah, look at that. Messed up. Uh, can I just, uh, yeah, let's just get rid of that. Let's dismantle that guy. Go and sit somewhere else, buddy. Uh, bench again. Our money is ro really rolling in. There's nothing we can't afford at the moment, airport wise. Come on, over there. Okay, now let's do the other side. I'm going to try and keep it in line with this. think it's like that so let's do this excellent come on come on uh, maybe up to about shall we leave that and build something around that yeah I think let's do that let's bring this back all the way on the other side oh we also need a little bit of seating downstairs as well for the uh, for the little gates but we'll get to that after this. So let's um, just continue to flesh it out over here. Oh, the, the gate is being used. Uh, I'm not necessarily sure it is being used. Where are they going? Oh, there's a little bit of a pathing thing going on, I think. Okay, now let's uh, finish these guys off. Okay, yeah, there's definitely some room over here that we can use for like stores and things. Now, what I wanted to look at is I wanted just to put a few garbage bins in place. So what we'll do is we'll just try and every every few every few benches will have one. Something like that. That should be okay. Um, I was kind of tempted to do something around there, but let's try and place a few more bins in a few other locations just so that there's bins fairly well spread out through this terminal building also maybe in the bathroom over here just see if we can get that to look and work and feel a little nicer um, if we go with some plants uh, what was some indoor stuff this was indoor stuff that was indoors but it was pretty huge so what I thought may be an interesting way for us to do it is just uh, do a little bit like this and then what we'll do is we will kind of close it off like that a little bit so there's uh, something that looks a little looks and feels a little bit nice like over there what I also thought we do is we just kind of have a have some no just cancel that project. I don't know why it's so easy to kind of miss the for it to just move. Um, and I think then we'll do a similar thing over here. So just uh, just a little bit of a nice feature in the airport over here. So this is kind of the open area. So let's get some floors going. If we're saying flooring, um, maybe can't remember what we used elsewhere. Oops. What did we use over here? It's this bluish color. Yeah, let's let's continue that. Let's not um, 
<clears throat> let's not mess things up too much let's go with flooring um, I'm looking for what exactly uh, actually I think it's stone it's not floor it's stone it's what we're after yes this stone 9a so let's grab that and let's kind of run that through here why all of the sudden do we have some issues I have no idea what's going on here now Something has happened. I'm just gonna leave. Uh, is it because it's middle of the night and there's maintenance going on? It may well be. So let's do a little bit of that. And what I'll do is I'll get the exit channels to do a little something else. And how did we do? Can we just go here and see what kind of flaws we have so we can get, yeah, one of these guys over here maybe for for that okay perfect yeah it's it's sorted out again i think it was just the maintenance work on the runway that was causing this area to become um, less optimal uh yes let's go downstairs and get some benches at least oh we also don't have any queues over here okay well let's um get some of these queues in place utilities queues um I'm almost wondering whether it's necessary. These are so small. Let's uh, let's let's forego the queues for now, and let's just put some benches in place over here. Um, oh, we also need obviously need some windows. But what I'm tempted in doing is just let's just get a bit too away like that. If we do something like this, and we'll have ourselves some seating. I think that's going to be more than sufficient for this guy. Um, how far away did we go here? One, two, three. One, two, three. Something like that. And let's just do three of them like so. I believe that should be fine. Nice. No, the very last one I end up doing exactly the same thing yet again. Okay, there we go. So there's some, some stuff that's going to go in there. Um, we'll have to start our work on this side. I go two away, but that's going to be... Uh, this one we may actually want to do a little bit like this. So let's do... Yeah, let's do that. And that. And yeah, that's going to be, that's going to look pretty good. So let's do this section like so. And will we, I think that we'll just leave as is so that people can actually get there. Uh, what we could do is we could just like add another little one over there so people can actually get out the exit channel over here. That's, yeah, that's, that's the right thing to do. There's some, some seating available over here for the guys wanting to make use of this. Um, the question is, should we continue with this shape or should we go back to that shape over there? I think almost this shape is probably best. So if we do... Yeah, that's going to be cool. Shall we? Yeah, let's do this. Let's um, let's do a little bit of that. Okay, now we'll give it a bit of a gap in between. Something like that. Now let's get the shorter ones. Uh, yeah, let's see. If we do that, and we'll close that one off, and we'll do this one, and we'll do that now. If we do the shorter ones, now that might be a little bit too much. Uh, actually, if we do this, it's going to be pretty cool. Let's uh, let's do that. Add a little bit of seating over there, and I'm almost tempted to just do some seating up against the wall over here also. Now, how's that? Uh, we could do a similar thing right there. There we go. So now there's a fair bit of seating around for these guys over here. Uh, we obviously need this so we can do some lounges and stuff in here is what I was thinking. Um, now we need, how does our sec 
security exit look we've got this green thing going on for the security exit so let's get the green floor uh, ready objects construction floors the green one is it this one is it that that number 20 that dark green one yeah it seems like it should be so we just want to make sure that we cover this entire area through there with that and then up here i wanted to do the same thing so we can i like to uh, to just segregate uh, with these flooring colors so you can clearly see what is supposed to be secure and what is the exit channel and on all these kind of things but it's kind of looking getting along nicely there um then we wanted to go with this stone 9a for the rest of this Uh, and the flooring takes ages to get built in this game so let's uh, let's try and get get all of that done and there we go flooring done uh, I'll do it through the through the doors as well okay now the, the terminal should be looking pretty good now uh, ooh, one more thing we do need a little bit of flooring here for the uh, for the bathroom so let's go with uh, maybe something a little fancier like that for these bathrooms here no run it through there that should be awesome okay good stuff now that will that construction will go um, yes now windows let's get some windows in place I know how you you guys like your windows everywhere so uh, we probably need to leave a little bit of room for the kitchen, but yeah, the kitchen can have a window too. So let's just wrap, wrap let's do a wrap around. We'll do some wrap around windows all the way around so you can have a nice terminal view. Yeah, that's going to be cool. Wrap around windows all around the way uh, up until uh, the bathroom. Uh, yeah. Well, you can. Let's do bathroom windows there as well. Cool. So now you have a little bit of an external view from the bathroom there too. Now, okay, let's... Uh, oh, we need to just do these as well. Yeah, that's cool. And then we'd have good windows all the way around over here. Okay, let's go downstairs and we'll do something similar. Uh, I'm going to do that... I'm going to do a uh, nice wrap around windows all the way around. Now the question is, I'm going to do this for the security also. So let's do up to there. Um, that's okay. We're not going to do that up to there there and we'll run it through like so like that and we'll wrap it around over here so lots and lots of windows that you're going to see over here so that makes the terminal look and feel a little bit nicer hopefully people are enjoying it a little bit more and the environment is going to pop up and nicely okay so let's quickly see the next step for us is we are going to do um going to do a, sh a store a shop and uh, and a cafe so if we go and say well we firstly we need a kitchen for the cafe so let's grab grab the kitchen and place a little bit of a kitchen area and maybe we'll do the kitchen on this side so that we um, we we don't block that nice view on the other corner there I think that's a nicer view of the runway that this this one will have it too so um where was the kitchen 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 this is alphabetical so it shouldn't be that difficult uh what's this house size limit four by four let's go with that as a kitchen knowing full well we're going to need uh let's do that full well and then we're going to want to put some walls in there you know what this could also be one of those kitchens that actually have uh, let's just grab a door the door is going to be uh, right up there maybe we could we could have these windows in the kitchens one of those kitchens where people can actually watch you watch you cook okay now zones uh, we want a cafe so this entire extent 
here will be a cafe so you go straight from the bathroom into the cafe which is fine now let's go to the construction again let's get those windows so this is where it's going to happen I'm going to put it in there ah, let's just put it everywhere so this is, kitchen is going to be nice and visible now under objects if we go to cafe we should be able to find the stuff that goes in the kitchen here they are so we definitely want a bit of a sink over there we need uh, actually I don't think there is where's the cooker oh there's the cooker there's a bit of a pizza oven a bit of a kitchen storage um, we need a bit of a cooker going on over here yeah let's do it something like that um, we're going to need a, a refrigerator place it in there and then we're going to grab ourselves a couple of hot plates and a prep cart or two uh, center over there now if we say assign to here now you now you know so now that kitchen should be workable now let's get our cafe going on so we're going to need a cash register um, I'm thinking something like this is good and then we need some chilled food displays let's get that right there we need some hot food displays we need yeah, let's just get another chilled food display and another hot food display over there. Then I was thinking over here and over there for coffee machines uh, and things like that. So that should be okay. Now we need some tables and chairs and I'm going to go with these guys. Um, let's do it a little bit more symmetrical this time. Uh, yeah, let's definitely place some stuff up against the windows. Okay, something like this should look pretty cool. Give me these chairs. So now let's say we're going to put some chairs in there. And I think it's just going to be tables for two mostly. Come on. A little bit of that, a little bit of this. On this side, we can have like three. Yeah, that's gonna be, it's gonna be how it's gonna work. Okay, let's get ourselves a bit of a garbage bin or two. We'll have one there, we'll have one here, and then we're just gonna have a couple out there so hopefully that should do well so now people can actually do something up here now let's uh, zone ourselves a little bit of a store on this side all the way like so and now we just need to see what kind of objects needs to go into retail uh, now we've got tons of little things but I'm tempted to well let's start off with the cash registers and I'm gonna place them Let's do a little something like that and see if we can put a little, maybe a candy display or two in between. Uh, no, I don't want something like that. I want something that's that's a little, I don't quite know, a jewelry display maybe. Yeah, that's cool. That's going to work well. Okay, now uh, we need to put some stuff in the middle. I, I like these kind of smaller ones because I just want to make sure that we place them in the middle of the store more than more so than anything else yeah something like that is kind of the way I want to do it and the jewelry display over there something like this a uh, shoe display um, be a little something over there souvenirs souvenirs and souvenirs anything else we need some of these let's uh, do some of these phone charging stations Ok, 
Okay, so that should be okay. Let's continue with this. There's some makeup stuff that we can put in here. Uh, maybe a bit of a pharmacy, something smaller maybe. Yeah, something like that. That should be okay. It's a little bit of everything really. I've got a book display already, I'm sure. But let's uh, add some more of that. Even one of these jewelry displays over there. It's a little bit of a mix and match going on. Um, and maybe, yeah, yet another uh, shoe stand. So these got these shoes on the ends there. So that's kind of what we got going on there with the store. So that's looking pretty good. The phone charges is, is, is working and working a charm over here. People are loving, lo loving them already. There we go. So phone charges available. I want uh, a couple of vending machines actually. So let's grab ourselves a food vending machine and a drinks vending machine right over there. So there's a little bit of action there as well. Excellent. So this, oops, wrong button. Excellent. So this terminal is starting to look really, really cool. Now, in terms of the lounges, so this area down here needs to be the lounges. And I can do numerous lounges in here. So let's just see what is the size that we need for and there's a difference between a first class and a staff but they're the same sizes so let's do i'm going to do kind of let, let's see so we're not going to do huge lounges so let's just do something like that right yeah let's do seven by nine lounges like that and bearing in mind we still need uh oh crap 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 okay fine Let's get ourselves the walls and up to where did we want to go with this? So up to around there, we'll bring in the wall like that. Now, one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Two, four, six. This is what we're going to do. Two, four, six. Two, four, two, four, six. Okay, two, four, six. There we go, and two, four, six. Uh, something like that. Uh, this isn't going to work, so we'll bring it in one more. We'll de demolish or dismantle <clears throat> this little section there so that we at least have appropriate sized um, little lounges over here. And these could actually be flight crew lounges while the rest is first. Well, we'll see a little bit of a, a mix, I'm sure. Um, okay, let's get back to the zones, first class lounges. Okay, so a little something like that. You're too small. One, two, three, four. No, you can't be. Oh, maybe there's some other criteria that we haven't met yet. Okay. Let's get some flight crew lounges going on also. So that would mean that we can actually give that to someone. So now doors, please. Okay, nice and center. Nice and center. There we go. Now that's good and good and well. Uh, let's get our just get fix those floors that we've got here. What did we do here? This was like a stone. Maybe the nine A there. Let's just fix that up. Oh, and I'll run it through there as well. Okay, so there's some lounges. We, <clears throat> we obviously need to kit them out a little bit, but I think then this area is kind of working. Oh, what we're still missing over here is let's get some garbage bins in place. Just so that it works a little better. Something like that, something like this. One over there. Something up there, something over there. Something up against the wall there, something in there. Nice. Okay, now this side, that side, this side, that side, and we'll just do 
a couple at, at the axis here, a couple going out of that zone there, or going out of, in, to the exit channel. Um, and maybe what I'll do is I'll put a couple in there as well. Nice, okay. Now that should be the terminal. We need to fix these things, put some stuff in there. Oh, no, 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 phone charges. Let's get the phone charges in place as well. So under retail, we had the phone charges and we could also do some, yeah, we'll, we'll get to that. Okay. Phone charges. Something like that. So there's a little bit of phone charges going on over there. And we'll do a similar thing. Over here. Okay, cool. Phone charges coming, ready. Okay, now, um, what did we need in here? I didn't quite, I can't remember. Some seating, let's see, objects, lounges, maybe comfort is probably what we're after. no idea what we should actually put in there but i kind of like the idea of like the coffee shops coffee kiosks um they're getting a little tight for these coffee kiosks those what we could do is we could grab coffee kiosks out here well various coffee and sushi yeah that's gonna that's gonna be work well so let's squeeze one in there let's see what other kiosks do we have <clears throat> a dessert kiosk something like that a health food kiosk over here a snack kiosk and a sushi kiosk and then uh, a flight information kiosk Something like that. Okay, do they need to be assigned a kitchen or something? Or they just get their stuff? Um, if we go upstairs and we say, assign to, oh man, we do need to assign them. Anyway, that's fine. So hopefully the guy will sort it out. Uh, what I'm worried about is can he Oh no, it might not be as simple as getting through here. I may have to look at whether that works or not. Going all the way through security, ex security exit and then coming back might be a little bit of a challenge for him. Um, let's do a few more things in the, um, under the cafe branch. Yeah, this is kind of, I wanted to go with these fancy chairs in the lounges. So let's, um, do a little something like that as kind of what we're going to do the setup in the lounges I think that should be kind of sufficient stuff here you can obviously place some other stuff in there as well but I don't I've never seen a lot of people in the lounges really so now we have lounges that we can assign to to the various um i know they're still very basic we need some plants and stuff in there as well we just cancel that project let's just get let's just get it filled up uh so now these guys are complaining because of course we probably need a different kitchen here for them So it doesn't seem like there's the ability to back and forth in this one. So we could. Yeah, we may have to add a, a little uh, escalator somewhere, maybe somewhere over here where they can go in the other direction. Oh no, that's not going to work. Hmm. Yeah, now we're a bit, a bit screwed. 
if we go on that side, it's not going to work. Unless we do one over here somewhere, maybe. Unless we, you know what we do? Let's just uh, switch the directions of one of them. So now, I believe that should be able to... The kitchen is assigned here. So I think that should work now. Yeah, I think that should be fine. Okay, guys, and that's what I'm going to end this episode. So I think this terminal is looking pretty nice um, at the moment. It's working really well. We've got all of this in place. There's still a little bit of work on this side as well. Maybe we still need some information signs and a PA system over here. But yeah, I think in the next episode, we may finish it off and just uh, clean it up and so on. And I think this that should be fine. We'll do a final tour of the airport, but it is really looking good now. Um, a lot of people very satisfied with it at the moment not quite at 80% and we'll see if we can work on that a little bit but I think it's overall it's pretty good we maybe need something like an arcade or or something like that guys I will see you in the next one if you've enjoyed it hit that like button and yeah have a good one bye bye